Okay guys, um, I'm going to show a quick video and explain how to do the new Cosmo Canyon skip that is, this is a much easier version and it's going to be the go-to version to do, you don't want to, you want to ignore any other video that does in-game time, um, frame perfect movements like constantly, so just watch what we're going to do here, hopefully I can do it in one shot and not have to redo the video, so when you exit Gold Saucer, doesn't matter what time you leave, so just naturally over the course of your speedrun, you leave and you hold down. Now, I am running this on my console right now, so this is how my console looks. Okay, so if this doesn't work for you, you'll have to find what pixel, you have to experiment with the proper spot, but you want to just hold down, you're going to keep tapping down, as you can see on my controller camera there, until you get to a certain point on the beach. It's one more down from here, if my controller will let me do it. Here we go. Bam. Okay, so now that you are here, so again, you can practice on emulator, on your own PlayStation, whatever you want to do, to start here. Now from here, you want to do only um, straight movements, no diagonals. So lefts, downs, ups, rights, etc. are all fine. Do not bonk on anything, do not hit anything, and only straight movements. And you want to get in and out of the buggy periodically, like normal, to skip encounters. So from here, from this part, you just hold left to get back to the beach, you know, and then just, you can get in and out of the buggy. None of these movements are precise, you can do it whenever you want, as long as you don't do a diagonal, you don't um, bonk on anything. Nothing here is precise, guys. Just make the trip any way you want. You know, you can just any way you want. I don't know how better to explain that than just any way you want. None of this matters. It's not perfect. It's not pixel perfect. This this river here is a little tricky, so you want to make sure that you get across without a bunk, and then you're pretty much good. None of the other stuff is too bad, right? Uh, another trick that I learned um, that uh, Kuma showed me, and uh, there'll be links to people's Discord, or not Discord, their Twitch, that found the skip and figured this out uh, in my description of the video here. But if you hold circle and hit X to get out, you'll automatically get back in. I gotta get used to that because I didn't actually know that was a thing. Uh, diagonals and bonks matter because it screws up what we did with that pixel perfect movement to go down to that beach. Think of it as locking the buggy in a set position that allows the glitch to work, okay? That's the best way, that's the easiest way to understand. It's a lot more complicated than that, trust me, but basically it's, that's all you need to know, is that one frame perfect movement that you did locks you into place. Okay, so now we're getting to the point where it kind of matters again. So, if you look over on the left here, you can kind of see this weird seam, almost like someone stitched the world map, right? Like, that's the event trigger for the buggy breakdown. So you wanna get past it just a little bit here. So you want your second wheel to be like right here. So just a little past it, okay? Just a little past it, right? Then we go up to here, this exact spot, where the buggy's just kinda overlooking the, uh, the cannon a little bit. Then it's one tap left, one tap, then one tap up, boop, out of the buggy, okay, in the buggy, hold left, and you're done. You're literally done. You're past it, you're good, diagonals are good again, you're fine, you're past the trigger, all right? So that is the new Cosmo Canyon skip. It does not require getting a chocobo. Um, now let me go back, so that now that the video actually shows the skip itself, there are two things you can do to get big guard. Uh, now I might break out break down the buggy here just coming back. Yeah, so see I just showed you that I didn't load a save that was already like You know done right? So that confirmed to you that this is all just one thing So what you could do to get big guard is as you're getting in and out of the buggy You could do the beach that we do the first, you know pixel perfect uh, spot and you could farm big guard there or come to the normal big guard beach and just run along it when you're when you're just cloud your movement does not matter only the movement in the buggy matters okay
So yeah, while this trick, as as Asa said in the stream, and while people are discussing this in the stream as I'm doing the video, it is precise, but it's not hard. So you could farm Big Guard on this on this beach again, and then just begin the buggy here and do the movement. But that's basically I the CC skip. Make sure to follow the guys that found it. Their information is going to be in my YouTube uh, description here. And they, this is the trick that has single-handedly saved the uh, FF7 speedrun community because the previous iterations of the CC skip were very difficult, and this is not in comparison. So, thank you guys. That's basically it for this video. Uh, please give a like if you found it helpful. Please post any comments if you have any questions. And subscribe if you like the video.